you can instruct your voice talent to download from the psquared.net website the remote voice tracking client and uh, it doesn't require a license so it will just uh, install and load up and this is what you'll see you are asked for username and password and also the server that you're connecting to so if you've already connected via VPN this would be the server IP address uh, that was hosting your remote edit server because uh, I'm hosting it on the same machine uh, as this client I've just put in the local host IP address 127.0.0.1 and so that would change to be whatever you want there there are some options here if we click on options you got station database so here it's open in the last station database that you used, which was Hot FM. Any local resources? So here is our local cart cache. So here is where it's uh, saving them locally on our machine and uh, how much our cache size can be, 5% of the drive. You have the ability to override the level trigger settings in the station database if you wanted to. And then profiles, we've just got one profile, but you may want to select some profiles um, depending on the station so this is just the profile for hot FM and then uh, that way we can go back in and reopen it and it will keep and remember all of these settings for us we can click on remember password if we want to but uh, this one is fine P squared and then uh, we click on connect and that will get you through to the system so uh, this is now connecting to the remote edit server and you can see down here it says connected to 127.0.0.1 which is our local file and so in our privileges we don't have the right to edit the current on-air hour which is uh, what this one is so uh, we're going to move across to the 1600 hour we're going to do some uh, moving around and some editing here so uh, we're looking at the 1600 hour which is an auto fade hour and uh, what this enables us to do we've got a, a go to here seg edit will bring up the opportunity to move and, and change the segs and do a voice in between them carts brings up the cart browser and preview enables us to select an item click on preview and then it, that will enable us to listen to the whole item in one of the cart players down at the bottom here so what we're going to do first of all is we're going to look at carts and that brings up our mini cart browser and this basically allows us to um, find some extra pieces of audio that we want added into the log we can either just do a find up here so if we wanted a uh, Kylie track then it will do a little find here and again this little icon comes up here when it's communicating back to the remote edit server so it all depends on the speed of your connection as to how quickly this search takes to uh, find its results So once it's done the search, it's uh, brought up our results and then that way we can drag this Kylie and we can stick it into the log. And so now that's written that addition back to the log in the radio station. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to do a uh, voice seg between these two, between Kylie and the Sugar Babes. So we highlight the song that we'd like to do the seg into and then we click on the seg edit button here. And that brings up, enables us to see it in Big View, Kylie and Sugar Babes. And then if we want to do a voice link between these two, then we just click on the microphone here. And uh, that will play the last few seconds of the track and the first few seconds of the next one. So uh, we click on that now. It prepares the cart, downloads. Carly Minogue and giving you up from Hot FM. This is Matt Wade here, and we're just about to fire off the Sugar Babes by the space bar. Sugar Babes starts playing, we can hear it in our headphones, and here they are, the Sugar Babes. Ugly. We hit the space bar again, and then it asks us whether or not we'd like to save the audio. And we just say yes. And so that's our voice link recorded, and uh, we can have a listen back to it now if we want to by uh, clicking on the uh, play button here. Plays the last few. And giving you up from Hot FM. This is Matt Wade here, and we're just about to fire off the Sugar Babes by the space. So we get uh, an idea of that. If we're happy, then we can click on the save button here, 
And what that does is uh, it saves all of the positioning in place and uh, it uploads it back into the uh, log back in the radio station. If we weren't happy and we wanted to delete that, then we can click on the X down here. It says, do you want to delete the voice custom car 8018? And we just say yes. And that removes it back off there. And then that enables us to do another voice link and uh, add that back in. Or we can just uh, use it to tweak around with that and uh, see if we're happy and just tweak with the segue. Don't need to do a voice link between them. When we're, when we're happy, we just click on the uh, floppy disk and that saves the new seg. And then uh, what we can do is we can just use the down arrow just to uh, scroll down to the next segue point. So between these two records here. We can do that or we can do something coming out of this ad break here. So uh, why not do that? So we click on the microphone. It pulls down the files, the, the last 10 seconds of the advert and the first 10 seconds That's of the music track. For. Pleasure comes in many forms. The new E-Class saloon from Mercedes Benz. So it's actually it's started the recording there already, which we're not happy with. So we're going to go no and we're going to hit that again. That's what you play golf for. Pleasure comes in many forms. The new E-Class saloon from Mercedes-Benz is just the latest. Visit eclass.co.uk. This is Hot FM, and uh, back now from the adverts, here's British Sea Power, and please stand up. And when we're happy there, we can uh, say yes, happy with that. Let's save that back, and it saves our voice link, uploads it back up to the system. And uh, what we could actually do, because we didn't want the music starting straight away, we could pull that out a little bit and uh, have a listen back. This is Hot FM. And uh, back now from the adverts, here's British Sea Power. And please stand up. So we're happier with that. So we click on the floppy disk to save that back. And then that sorted out that segue for us. And again, we just scroll down to the next time that we want to add something in. So that is uh, how to segue. If we actually wanted to... Uh, uh, hear a whole song, for example, we could highlight this uh, Lucy Silver's track and uh, click on preview. And so now what it's doing is it's pulling down the whole of the song and uh, now it's decompressing it down and uh, we should be able to pull it down into a cart player and we get the whole length of the track and we can uh, listen to it. This just uh, enables us to hear the whole track. If we were, are not too sure how it sounds, then uh, just uh, enables us to have a good old listen. So that's the preview. So we've done go to, enabling you to jump around. Seg edit enables you to change the segs, insert your voice link. Carts brings up the mini cart browser. And preview enables you to pull a whole song and uh, preview a whole song down. You have the ability to manipulate the log, drag things up and down, uh, soft delete stuff by clicking on the icons. It really is kind of like being there in front of the machine. And uh, so that is how you do your remote voice tracking. If we uh, stay connected and we just minimize this down, we can have a look at what the remote edit server is doing. And so you can see various bits and pieces that it's been doing. There's our voice links here coming out of uh, the golf advert and then sticking that in. Please stand up our track and there when we requested 3104, which was uh, that Lucy Silver track, it says that it sent the file to the client. And so we've got it there. And you can see where we deleted that log item, that mixed sweeper. So you get a full list of what's there. You can see the current user logged in when they connected. And uh, like I said, you can go up there and reset connection to force them out if you wanted to. So that is remote voice tracking.